we talked about it last week. North Korea anymore. sending 10,000 troops, apparently, uh, to Russia. They, I, I, so what I read, Woody, uh, there's mm. like 3,000 of them or some special unit that's been training in secret in Eastern Russia for the last like year or something like that. So those guys are being sent in. And the, the latest from Zelensky is if he's not invited into NATO, he's going to build a nuclear weapon. He says he can build one in as little as like a couple weeks or something like that. Because you may not know this. I, I didn't until today. Ukraine is where all the nuclear weapons were made in the Soviet Union. They've got like factories built and ready to go to like make mm. nuclear weapons. Uh, they had the third uh, highest amount of nuclear weapons before they gave them all up uh, behind us and the and Russia. I know they and, have uh, nuclear power. So it makes sense that like they're not just some idiots and with, you know, with podcasts. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we don't have yeah. any nuclear power at all. <laughs> not one of us. That we don't even know where to start. Nope. Have a little. Oh, come on. There's a YouTube video. You have to sell a lot of cars. You need a little. <laughs> Kyle's like, I could do it. I'll start Googling. All right. So, <laughs> oh, 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 dude, you, there was a. Uh, I don't know if you've heard of this. Like 800 uh, smoke detectors. I don't know if you've heard this story. <laughs> I'll that. Uh, it, I don't. I'll have to try, or maybe Zach can find the guy's name. There was this kid like a couple decades ago. In like the U.S., like one of the like one of the Dakotas, I don't fucking know. But the nuclear he became Boy like, yeah, the nuclear boys guy. I'm surprised you. I'm not surprised. You know, this is the kind of thing you would know. This guy, like, got obsessed with nuclear power, and so like secretly started getting material that he could build a nuclear reactor in a shed in his backyard with smoke detectors. And it got to the point that like, like people were having to investigate because they would like det- detect. A huge amount of radiation coming from like this neighborhood, burns, and he dude. had radiation burns if at one point. If he was from Zimbabwe, you guys would be mocking him. Well, ex- except no, this dude, guy, it, if, if it would, if it if it didn't work, I think we'd mock him. But this guy was killing himself effectively with how <laughs> with how, with how <laughs> effective his genius. nuclear reactor was. What do you yeah. got out there? Methamphetamine? <laughs> you wish. <laughs> you wish. No, this guy's fucking wish. Yeah. I got eight kilos of radium that I salvaged out of some old <laughs> smoke detectors. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so he built like a functional nuclear reactor that uh, was I, not, not, like, oh not like a real deal God. one. Well, wait a goddamn minute. Look at this. It, it worked enough that it created power and it had the power to kill him. Well, Did he it, die? Holy I, shit! Look, I at, think no, he's, he's still fine. alive. Where he's is fine. David Hahn now? I uh, want to know more about his reactor. It, it's, I think, I think it's what I no, said. No, he's dead. He's, oh man, I was thinking PK seven twenty three. David Hahn's in the Unrelated. He died in twenty sixteen at the age of thirty nine. Oh. He died from intoxication of alcohol, fentanyl, cancer? fell and off a fourth floor. Balcony in Argentina. They took his reactor away. No, oh, diphenhydramine. That is Benadryl, I think. Isn't it? Mm. Oh, they Something took Homeboy's there? reactor away, and he never, uh, he never got it back. Yeah, I, he probably OD'd because he was uh, miserable. Yeah, nuclear from, energy is always the energy, uh, energy crisis. And he was trying. Energy isn't, isn't usually a hobby that people go into. It's more of a profession. Uh, they mm. they sort of frown on, frown on you just. Frown dipping your toe that's, into that's a that's a hobby radio. i'm okay with us legislating pretty uh, pretty stringently oh, against oh, no, 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 oh what happened to libertarian where's the freedom of speech now I'm i can't have a miniature nuclear <laughs> reactor in my basement i can't i can't fizz a few atoms here and there this is how i express myself i the, when you're the, right you're the, right the material <laughs> is going to decay whether i'm harnessing its power or not taylor it's going to happen i didn't build that school there Keeping the government they, out of the backyard. <laughs> they don't get to cool there. Yeah, <laughs> it's my, not my fault. The baseball diamonds glowing. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I don't know nearly enough about uh, uh, radiation to to start my own re- reactor. I saw a video of what the ladies' hands who used to like test the X ray machines, like the, the nurses in the old timey doctor's office, would like give themselves an X ray and make. All right, it's on. It works every fucking day. And so they, they'd be all rotted out and like ruined. Their hands would be ridiculous. Uh, that's it's like those uh, radium watch liquors from like the 1920s where they would like lick the paintbrushes that had radium on it yes. because they were painting oh, radium yeah. to the, the watch face. And I guess back then they're like, oh, bunch of radium on here. Better straighten it out with my tongue 11 times every hour. And they're all like, dude, that's so off. cool. But so- I mean, at some point it's like, Let's say you join that job and like one of your coworkers 
has like a whole half of her jaw missing because she's been doing it for 15 years. Like they don't keep her on staff, bro. They, they, they usher her out. For you think they get her out of there? It starts, starts rotting away. They put a Hannibal Lecter mask on her. <laughs> I've been in, I was in a Russian armored personnel carrier and it's gauges where that stuff is radium. And even it's pitch black in there. The thing buttons up completely. Mm -hmm. And it's like everything glows with mm. no electricity, with no electricity at all. Like the thing could be completely out of power and you could be in the pitch black darkness, but you've got all your clusters and, and gauges and gizmos to operate because of the radium. It was you buy radium jewelry and dishes and stuff. Wow. Oh, that's uh, uranium. Oh, am I mixing it up? Okay. Yeah, it's uranium glass. It, it, that, that used to be the only uh, use for uranium was uh, making certain types of ceramics and certain types of glass that, uh, that, that glow under um, black light or UV light, one or the other, maybe both. Hmm. Are there any nuclear cars? No, not. Uh, they're a little hard to carry around nuclear reactors at this point, other than in Back to the Future, right? Oh, and I appreciate well, how gentlemanly you handled that terrible question. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I hey, thought I saw something in, on Back to the Future. Are there any nuclear cars? We put them in submarines. And what is That's a car it. if not a land-dwelling small submarine? <laughs> <laughs>